This literally could be any shoe here. Shattered backboard 3.0. saw Chris Angel and David Blaine on TV, and that was something my dad watched. But it wasn't until the age of six where he showed me a trick. Now, that's what my memory serves. Maybe he showed it earlier, and I just didn't remember that. But six years old, he showed me my first trick and absolutely changed my life. Kevin Hamden from Toronto has had magic on the brain since a young age and has been trying to follow in the footsteps of some of his idols. The first trick I ever did was at a young age, and it wasn't, uh, well, it wasn't a successful trick. I told someone to think of a card, and I just guessed it, and it was completely wrong. But it was the first step, the first step of doing mentalism. Do you feel anything at all? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah. You feel that, right? Yeah. See, it comes right off my hand. I never touched you. Hamden isn't making mistakes now, and his talents are being talked about all over the city and social media. The mentalist has more than 400,000 followers and rising. Street stuff is me essentially doing what I do on a close-up level, the mind reading and influence. So as a mentalist, my job is to create the illusion of mind reading, suggestion, and influence. And the clips that you're seeing from the street are me going on the street to people and just getting inside their head. That's essentially it, getting them to think of something, revealing it, or even putting a thought in their head. There's even stuff that I've done where it's connections between people. One person reads another person's mind. The other person gets a feeling, a similar feeling that the other one has, like a touch on the nose or on the arm, and the other person feels that. Hamden is now being asked to perform in front of celebrities and famous athletes, and is hoping to inspire other magicians to keep pushing forward, despite what others say. Going back, watching the videos for me, it gets me, it gets me emotional in a, in a, in a sense like you know I was able to overcome all the negativity I was able to overcome all the people that said hey you can't do it don't do it you're out of your mind and knowing and looking back and seeing hey me in that time I was fighting for it I was out on the street I was performing I was doing what I had to do and not stopping and that's the one thing that I never want to forget and I think everyone watching this should never forget never forget day one never forget the day you started and why you started because that's gonna keep you going forever imagine typing it in Think of the first. Okay. Interesting. Sorry. Is it two 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 seven? <laughs> Hamden hopes to end up in Las Vegas for a residency like many of his idols. In Toronto, I'm Brandon Rowe for City News.